Bobbylicious boys and girls, welcome back to Bobbylicious Gaming, and welcome back to Darkwood. Welcome to our hideout. When last we had played, we survived night number two. Oh, Beth's still here as well. She's, she's still here. We're, we're, we're still, <laughs> I never left becoming we're still, a chair. <laughs> we're still continuing on. Um, did a little stuff around the shop that I want to tell you about. We upgraded the workbench, which gave us a couple new recipes, but we need some expensive uh, stuff. Um, namely the fabric that this trader has. Um, I turned in the shiny stone for a little bit of extra reputation points. I am going to take a drink of this. I was about to lay it down without doing that. Because ah, I'm good at that. Um, and, uh, but we're just, our goal is to build a reputation, and today we're going to act on the invitation that we got to the wedding. Are you ready for the wedding? I'm ready for the wedding. I also... Uh was gonna tell my story that I was gonna yes, tell Yes, you have to tell the story. So. Everybody's been on a cliffhanger since like, <laughs> for like four days because I posted <laughs> Bug Fable as well. But I was gonna say, I, uh, I mean, honestly, it's not that great of a story. And now, honestly, now it's, now it's been I have up. to remember. It was something about you and Danielle story... at the no, pool. No, I know, we were in the pool, but oh! Okay, so in the last episode, Bobby was doing like this little thing with his hands. So that's what really honestly reminded me of it. So, long story short, it's not even that great of a story. Daniel and I were in our parents' pool, and uh, when we were swimming, like, obviously, I just don't like bugs in general. I just hate them. Um, and even bugs that don't harm you, I don't, I don't like them. Like, don't touch me. <laughs> I'll keep on my side, you keep on your side. So, um... There was a dragonfly. In fact, there was like kind of a swarm of dragonflies. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, near the pool. There was this dragonfly like flying around me specifically. And he kept like doing this, doing this circle around the pool. And Dale's like, he's trying to be cool. I was like, oh, I'm not sure he's trying to be cool. So she's like, don't worry. I'll warn him off. And she starts doing this. <laughs> and I'm like. Like what? underwater? No, no, no. She's above the water going, don't worry. And I'm like, what is that doing, Neil? She's like, no, no, it's just warding him off. I'm like, that's not doing anything. So, long story short, uh, that was my story. <laughs> but it was, I thought it was pretty comical. because think now, that's great. Now, whenever Danielle and I are in the car, uh, just driving around, I'm like, we'll be listening to music and just start doing that. Good. So, it's a pretty, it's a pretty fun thing. That's how you ward off, is that, is that how you'd ward off anything? I guess that's the question that we need to ask Danielle is... Is that what's necessary to ward? Oh, some pillies. Nice. I don't know. Our sister is definitely, uh, definitely random with her, uh, I'm not saying I'm not, but, like, she's definitely random with some of the knowledge that she has, so maybe that is the key. That's a warding spell of some sort. And then she was like, don't worry, Beth! And she kept splashing him with the water from the pool. Finally, so sure he, he left. he just loved. Yeah. It was pretty great. You are having a stroke. Yeah, well, it's a, it's a hedge maze, and I don't... Hey, tractor, more gasolina. Cool. It's a hedge maze, and, uh, you know, all I want to do is get to this wedding, and they're making it difficult. It's like, do you want me to come to your wedding or not? I didn't bring a present. I just brought some gasoline. I don't even think this is actually the farm. I think this is just... What? I didn't like that. That was squealy. I don't like my guy's heavy breathing. Well, maybe you should just build up some of that stamina. I don't even think there's a way to do that. Like, to extend your stamina bar. No, I mean just, like, let your guy rest for a couple seconds. You know what? He needs to get this cardio in. That's how he... Why did that sound like he was biting on an apple? Maybe he was. True. Now he's dead. Alright, we have reached the farm where the wedding is being held. I like that, like, your vision can kind of, like, go through. Hey! Ooh. Ooh, he's on a chain. Oh, I genuinely thought that was a worm or something, and I was like, mm. Alright, well, you can just stay over there, Jacko. Oh, this is a... What do they call the harvester? Or whatever. Hello, I came for the wedding! Did I get meat? Did I bring meat? I did not. Well, I don't know how I'm gonna get past this dog aside from just 
Give him a proper good whacking across the face. Haha, -ha, you have been... I don't have any skills. Oh, wait. That's all I get from I was like, what? Look at that wedding. That's a wedding I want to have. Yeah, you know what? Make mine dark wood themed. Honey. Are those supposed to be streamers? Fu future wife, wherever you are, this is what our wedding's going to be. The chair. Oh boy. Yeah. There's us dancing. Yep, yep, you can just not do that. An old wagon decorated with colorful stuff. Yep. Yeah, that's that's cool. Full disclosure, I don't think I've ever done this mission. They show it in the gameplay trailer, and that's what convinced me to buy the game. But Go down. But I'm I'm not about it. I'm I'm okay with. Look, there's still food on the table and stuff. You gotta go, yeah, you gotta go down. <laughs> I know what's going on. No, we gotta go in the metal door over here. That's what the code was eight two three zero. Because I can't see in the windows or anything. You asked, there. you asked me before realistically what the scariest thing would be. That. Oh, she looks up. Did you see that? It's like a real face, but like, what, 4261? We should try that on the other lock, because it's not the right code. It's 8, what was it, 8230? I thought it was 8263. Yeah, well, guess what, you were wrong. I thought you just said 8263, and that no, was... No, 4261 was what was... Y'all good? Door seems to be jammed. Cool. That's the kind of stuff I get done for. What is that? No, wait, 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 wait. Hi there, Piggy. Piggy! Piggy, Why does that look like Milo sitting down? <laughs> Mummy. <laughs> um, cool, 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 cool. Uh, I'm gonna What eat. is your guy doing to the pig? I don't like that! He's... I was digging in my... What do you got in there, Piggy? <laughs> what you got in there? <laughs> don't, don't do that. I don't know. I'm eating bread so that I have better lung capacity. I don't know why that's a thing, but it is. Uh, what did I... What did I need that extra stuff for? Consumable heals. I'm gonna need them, I know it. Okay. Piggy, be a good boy. Okay. Lovin's it. Love that! Loved it! Woo! <laughs> oh, it's on! Oh, boy. Ready for the wedding. Rusty track to overgrow. Oh, we have a steering wheel and some roots. more. Yeah, let me just let me just hop through this window. What, what the heck? What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. Yep. What is the worst that could happen? Hi. We've been waiting. Oh, not on. For me. Yep. I don't know. Are you gonna be okay if I turn this off? Ah, that doesn't seem to bother him. Yeah, he was just, not doing it in time just to- Just, where are you going? Well, I just gotta know. Wanna dance? No, not particularly! Dude, dance I join. You. No. <laughs> like, teach me dance. how to dance! No, 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 it's alright. No, 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 I, I don't want to. I don't know where I'm supposed to be. Will you dance with me? No, I will not. One, two, three. Okay! I didn't do that! I didn't write that! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't write that! He's not. No room in my inventory. That's fine. Bed. Good night. We've been waiting for no, you. Go after him, dude. Just no. No, it's okay. Dance with me. No, I don't want to. Yeah. No, keep the table in the way. The table's fine where it is. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good geek. I can't. I couldn't even hit her. That is a googie. <laughs> That's a definition of a googie. <laughs> you know what it reminded me of? It reminded me of the things from Stranger Things. Yeah. 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 I couldn't even hit her. Ah, oh. you need a gun. I'm sorry. Who? That's what an owl says. 
No, dog, stay over there. I'm just getting some mushrooms. I'm just getting some mushrooms. I was just getting some mushrooms. You know what this music sounds like? It sounds like um, on Spongebob when Mr. Krabs... Am I making too many Spongebob references? <laughs> Maybe. But when Mr. Krabs goes crazy and he's trying to get that giant clam to come... <laughs> Yeah, because it's like... Yeah, it's basically just like the Jaws music. Yeah. Did I get the other one? I don't think I actually pulled it up. Nope, I just got one. I didn't even get the other one. Oh, shoot, you were waiting for me. What's up there? Fine, Dude. kill me. What are you doing? I'm trying to live my best life, okay? Shoot him or something. I don't have a gun. Can't use your stick. Fine. You want some? You got some. <laughs> Shouldn't have messed. Still don't condone hitting animals, but... I get that. Sometimes. But we're, at, we're here where we, we're, we're at where we're at. When they're rabid and they're trying to eat you. What? Okay. <laughs> what if you did get married? And, like, a month after you guys were married, your wife just, like, turned to you in bed and was like, <laughs> just turned into that alien monster thing that you just saw. But she was like, I'm gonna spare you, and then <laughs> left. What would you do? I'd be like, thank goodness. <laughs> True. I, I dropped my lockpicks! I'm going back. I had two lockpicks. I could have opened that crate. There would have been goods in there. Dude, I don't have time for you, elk. Deer, elk. I don't have time for you. It's a hybrid. It's called a... It's a milk. Milk? Moose and elk. Oh, I thought we were talking about, like, deer and elk. Delk. Because it's clearly not a moose. A mook? I don't know. An elouse? Ah! I'm flustered. That's the problem. I'm flustered. You're really bombing. Thanks for the support. You're welcome. What do you think? Do you think I should go back? Oh, 100, dude. Oh, we're here anyway. Honey? Is my stuff still here? She didn't kill you over here. Yeah, okay. She killed you in the house. You're right, you're right. Dude, that music's still bopping. Yep, love it. My favorite, my stuff! Yes! Say, dude, just get it and get out. Do you hear that? They're coming for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, I know. I just wanted to get everything. get everything that was there i feel like she no i don't think good. you did because you didn't go down here did you no, I, I did this so i got around yep because we're random there's the piggy oh yeah piggy pig is this locked dude i don't have the key oh they that door's like locked locked oh the generator's toast yeah I don't, I don't want to dance say so you can wait a minute you can't turn off the radio. That is something. Nah. We're done. We got what we could. I probably would have got something good if I had killed her, like, outright. But you know what? Whatever. I'm getting the heck out of Dodge. Torch went out. That's fine. You're just gonna make it home now. Dude, night. see? Not so bad. You had an encounter with a Gugib and then you're fine. Yeah, great. Magnificent. My favorite of all time. You know, in the last episode you had mentioned that you were hungry for like a good boygie. Mm -hmm. Dude, I definitely want a burger. Yeah, in and out sounds really good. Right Ugh, in and out's bomb. Down, hands down. That's a rooster. A dying rooster. Yeah, it sounds like it. Speaking of dying animals... Literally, 
I didn't okay. like that. Nope. Oh, shoot. I got to turn on the thing. I don't like... There's this chihuahua that's outside in our neighbor's yard. And it just... It's... It, you know, chihuahuas have that certain bark that they're just like... Arr, arr, arr. And when they do that, they don't sound right. They sound like they're dying. But they're not. It's just their normal bark. And it's very annoying when you're trying to fall asleep. That's the end of my story. Um, thank you. Thank you, for, thank you for doing the entertainment, because I am not. You're welcome. Anytime. I sound like a robot. Um, hey. <laughs> one entertainment. Please insert one coin for more entertainment. Um, what was I saying before, though? Oh, no, in and out in and out probably by far is one of my favorite places. There's a lot of people that I've talked to that are just like, in and outs not that great. And I'm like, you know what? That's <laughs> that's your opinion. Yeah, that's wrong. That's your opinion. It's very wrong, but I'm not going to correct you. I'm just kidding. No, I just, I don't know. I really like them. Cool. Um, so uh, I will admit, we, we've we made, I don't want to say we've made enemies. It's too dangerous to correct during the night. Okay. Well. Uh, we've made enemies, not the Hold best. on, everyone! I'm cooking a good mac and cheese! Get out! <laughs> Call out to my macaroni and cheese episode. Go watch it if you haven't watched it. This is great. It's good stuff. But I was not being attacked by monsters when I was doing that. Um, but we've made a couple enemies. We've made enemies with the wedding. We've made enemies with um, the deer man by me smacking him. The milks are out there. So, um, you know. Anything can happen. I feel like I've been gearing up these nights to be something scarier than, they, than they've than they been at this point. I mean, we had but the shadows the last time. What's eerie about it is when, like, you encounter a night that people are just talking and they're like... Yeah, I heard that. The door open. I don't know. But when people are talking, like, let me in, and they're just like, didn't like that. It's more the eerie aspect. I heard you open the door. Don't, don't confront him. No, I'm not. I'm not him come to me. I'm not going out there. Mm -hmm. You can drink from my well. I didn't drink from it today. Well, well, well. Fancy seat. <laughs> 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 Yawn. <laughs> what up, my yeek? That comic relief, though, am I yeah, right? This is tense. I'm sitting here, I'm like, what jokes can I make? What jokes can I make? No. Death, destruction. <laughs> uh, my bride tried to Anything kill me. Anything negative? The bride tried no. to kill me. There's I feel like even when you watch like, horror movies and stuff like that, you, can, you gotta have that comic relief. To make it so that you're not sitting here like, I'm about to pee my pants. There's that rooster. Whoever made the, uh, the sound effects and the audio for this game. A1. Well done. A1 stink sauce! How'd you just weasel your way in? He's okay, listen. Get out of my house. There's a breach in the defenses! Watch it in there. Watch it. Alright, if it's just dogs, I can deal with that. What's that moving over there? Oh, it's a tree. Is it? I don't see the tree. It is a tree. Another one. Ugh, these dogs. Really anticlimactic. Like, come on. Give me a give me a googie. I want a googie. I don't want these dogs. Dogs are A-OK -okay by me. I want to be terrified. I have never ever since I watched Insidious, I no horror movie has scared me like that. It always takes that one horror movie though. For everyone, I've had conversations like this with people. They're like, yeah, I've seen this movie, and this is the one scary movie that, like, made me... I've never been scared since. And I was like, dude, I feel it. 
Even if it's a lame movie. It gets to you. Yeah. Well, that was lame. <laughs> hey, it was two dogs. We heard somebody opened the door. I want to know which door was opened. I'm okay. not going to check. Do it. Do it now. Do right, it. Fine. Who's Do in it. here? There was no doors open. Oh. <laughs> That's spooky. They fall. 100 reputation, baby. Let's go see what our boy the traders got, and then we're going to call this an episode. As I approach the man drops a sack, blah, blah, blah. He does what he do. Oh, I gotta cook my mush first. Where do you think he goes to survive? Or do you think anybody tries to even mess mess with him? I feel like since he's got the goods, he's gotta be, he's gotta hole up somewhere. Like, there's gotta be somebody that's protecting him. A gold handle, I think that's for the hunter. But why does he have a sack full of charcoal? Like, what are you doing with that charcoal, my dude? That's how he communicates. Look, he's right, he's got it written, he's writing on his arm. I didn't notice that. Yeah. Isn't that cool? Yeah. I want to buy I mean, I don't know that I'd call it cool. I mean, if I met somebody that was writing on their arm, I'd be like, oh, you're crazy. Well, the thing is, he's got, he's in some sort of protective suit to protect him from the disease. And that's why, I, that, that was one thing I was going to comment on is I love the like little animations that they have for these guys and like the design that goes into them. I look at this dude, he's like in like some sort of like cosmonaut suit or something or like some yeah. sort of hazmat suit. And they even said in the last, uh, when we first met him, like, he's talking behind it, but we can't hear what he's saying. Yeah. So, we'll call him. Yeah, just beat open that door. <laughs> you know it's good. It's probably because he's still shaking. Wait, what from was that, that one night. thing? 4261? Let's try that. Good memory. Maybe. Wrong. Dang. How many combinations are there with four numbers? 10,000. Whoa! I don't know how you did that math real quick. Well, it's... But I'm not smart at math, so that's probably why. You have to count for 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, every number from 0, 0, 0, 0, all the way up to 9, 9, 9, 9. So every number in between those two numbers... So it'd be 10,000 plus 1,000, basically. Hmm. No, that's not true. Sorry, my math was right. It's 10,000. Wow. I'm just going to shut my mouth. Hey, man. I'm impressed. More importantly, there's a walkthrough that I could probably find it on. So that's where we're going to call this an episode. What an eventful time. We went to the wedding. Is my barricade still set up? Good. Ah! We went to the wedding, had a terrible time we there. We weren't ready for the wedding. We were, I was not ready. I you were you were like yeah whatever that, that thing tried to eat you it did eat you whatever it's fine um but we got our stuff back and i think we're ready to move on we're going to try to move into the next area so that we can start this mission for the wolfman so today's expedition day three's expedition next episode epi next expedition next episode right <laughs> is gonna be that so thank you guys for checking in as always i really appreciate you beth Thank you for being here and being comic relief while my palms sweated. Um, Sweat. And I hope that you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye! Bye.